Peace. This is Jarrell with Quantum Light Consciousness. Today, we're going to talk about increasing your crystalline energy body integrity with crystals. All right. Now, there's a lot of different ways to heal with crystals. There's a lot of different ways to actually go into your energy body and increase your integrity. Um, one of the ways to do it is with crystals. Why? Because crystals are actually the highest type of integrity that you can possibly get because um, everything is crystalline everything is made out of light everything is a form of that carbon life form that silica life form from the base center of creation itself all right it's what everything that is intelligent is made out of all right that's why they try to simulate intelligence with crystals with computers okay so um crystalline energy is what you want to use to heal okay so when you start getting into your energy body integrity when you start in enhancing and increasing your energy body strength resilience and robust power force um, because there's forces involved when you get into your own energy um, you actually get to understand yourself as an integratable being like a crystalline tree like a living crystalline tree like imagine if a tree was a crystal or a crystal was a tree and that tree was in the shape of a human that would be your energy body okay except of course a human an actual living self-aware human okay in the form of a source being like from the pure source living energy okay so to get there is basically what I want to kind of guide you guys towards and getting towards that integratable place because there's a lot of things that kind of just run you around in circles same people repeating the same stuff same things going on in the collective where you don't really know if you've made progress because you're never actually going in on your inside and then looking at your progress seeing what you've implemented and seeing your results based off of you looking at your energy body for yourself okay because that's what it's about it's looking at yourself for you and looking at you based off of the results that you get and the results that you're looking to obtain and bring into your physical health emotional health energetic health and your day-to-day -day life all right so the easiest way to do this is basically just sit with a crystal or sleep with a crystal and just allow that crystal to be with you and feel that crystal's energy. All right, simple. That's it. All right. Um, now, it depends what type of crystal. All right, again, there's tons of crystal guys out there. People know everything about crystals, but they have never accessed their energy body. Like, they. they, they They've never actually like gone out of body and experienced themselves as just their energy body. All right, they're like an encyclopedia of crystals, which is totally over. all right. Like that's fine. Like knowledge is power. Like, but what are you doing with that power? Like, you can use knowledge to get more knowledge, or you can use knowledge to actually embody the knowledge that you've accumulated and you continue to speak about and teach. Okay, so. There's different types of crystals you can use for this, man. Like, I only speak on this blog based off of my personal experience, and I learned what crystal to actually utilize from from a healer that I actually interviewed on this blog. Um, I watched one of her videos, and she said that before I, before I even interviewed her, I watched one of her videos, and I bought a crystal, and she said that this is like the one of the best crystals she's used and um it was the crystal argonite so i i bought that crystal and i started working with it and then i looked at this crystal and i realized that this, that this crystal was probably like one of the most special crystals that i had previously encountered like i had never encountered a crystal like this before mainly for the fact that when i looked at it it started shape-shifting like it literally started shape-shifting into like little baby animals like like it's like basically the makeup of this crystal it's like a cluster of energy of of like 
like a root of a tree like if you were to dig out a root like the core root of a tree in the ground and have it be in crystalline form that would be this crystal organite all right so the crystal is alive the crystal is totally has an intelligence a spirit of its own from the get-go and shaped like a tree just like your energy body so that's basically why i bought it because I, I i looked at it and i was like oh it's shaped like a tree i should probably buy that all right so 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 i bought it and i started working with it and basically what you do is when you have any type of crystals like you can program them or you can grid them or you can utilize them to help them help you wake up like help you energetically become more awakened in your day-to-day -day life and the best way to do that is kind of like for me at least is to put them in your bed all right put them in your bed and just like lay with them next to you and see what happens all right so with this particular crystal the way i use it to basically increase my energy body resilience and integrity was to use it utilize it on my stomach all right so when i utilize it on my stomach basically what i had was my energy going 1080 degrees and then compounding on itself and expanding and developing all the energetic space around me because I had that core stability and integrity that I was resonating with just from this very little crystal core mini organite okay so it's important to clear crystals when you do things like this when you clear crystals you want to have an angel or one of your guides clear it and then the bonus of that is you also get that enlightened energy that that enlightened angelic or extraterrestrial healing energy and when you know your own energy field when you know how to spin your own energy field all you have to do is lay down on the bed and then spin your energy field then all of a sudden you're basically getting more power out of your little energy body as a little human here on the physical planet earth than you ever had before this is basically what happened to me now the reason why i use the stomach is because the stomach is the power center the stomach is your energy reservoir the stomach is where your reserves of frequency is going to be harnessed from and output from so when you have a clean stomach that's probably that's probably the highest level of of clarity that you'll get just because um, a clean stomach is like not allowing anything to be able to make you sick okay um, and when you understand your own resonance of your own clarity in your own clean and refined high frequency health from a resonance level of empathy of your own stomach from the inside out when it's integratable like that, that helps you resonate into higher levels of capacity and and health and, and just higher well-being of being enlightened as an energy being, okay? Helps heal your aura, helps strengthen your aura, and helps solidify and it helps you crystallize more of your own vibration so you become more of yourself, okay? Just by this little crystal, okay? that's basically what is most important is that you actually resonate with crystals okay because crystals are actually living crystals actually have an an intelligence of their own if you would just like put your phone down and tune in to the crystal instead um because unfortunately um tech companies are using crystals in negative ways and they put artificially created crystals into phones and then they have artificially intelligent crystalline beings like fucking your shit up with the phones and getting into your third eye and doing all types of shit so if you would tune into crystals instead you see that a lot of crystals actually have whole worlds in them they have worlds like galaxies in them all right like little miniature like like super minuscule microcosm little crystalline kingdoms okay and you can also use these crystals to actually like reset and realign your energy body your third eye 
your heart chakra, your throat chakra, your sacral chakra, which is what we're basically talking about. Like, like crystals are very powerful, and if you take the diligence and the discipline and the initiative to work with them and kind of break away from the herd based off of your own perception of them and not like the rehash stuff that a lot of people are just kind of repeating over and over again then you'll see progress and you'll start to rise above the water level and actually get out of the uh you know what you might want to call the levels of confusion and the looping mindsets that a lot of people get caught in so peace and love if you guys like a session i do sessions at quantumlight.net i do healing intuitive coaching energy reading numerology readings custom light code attunements and a whole lot more all right coming up soon so talk to you soon peace